Finally, I can't believe it's happening. Hello guys, my name is Michaela, I'm 20 years old. I'm a media communication student in Bath, UK. This sounds like a CV. Anyways, you ask where that is. It's nearby Bristol, but also very close to London. It's like one hour away by train. Many of you probably remember me from the Vivox 7 web series and also from my previous YouTube and Vivox channel. I decided to continue vlogging because that's what I enjoy the most, but this time in English. Yeah, I know, you ask why or even react negatively, but since I live in the UK, I thought that's a great opportunity to share my lifestyle, not only with Bulgarians, but also with people from all over the world. My channel will be an open book about myself. I will share with you everything that I personally find interesting. I will talk about issues that closely affect our interests. I'll be very happy to discuss them together and find answers to all questions. Moreover, we'll not only have fun, but also talk about fashion. And you can always ask questions, share ideas with me. I will honestly be so happy to communicate with you all. Let's begin with today's topic. I want to share my experience in the UK and why I chose Bath. To be completely honest, I didn't want to go to Bath exactly. My first intention was to live in my favorite city, London, as you all know. But I chose Bath because uh, of the fact that the uni, or more particularly the course, there was more suitable for me. I thought that at this point of my life, I should focus on my studies rather than on partying in London. I do go to London very often, so not living there is not a problem at all. Nevertheless, I faced many obstacles in Bath, which made me wonder for a moment, what if I made a mistake? Nothing happened the way I expected it. I thought I would meet the most wonderful people, um, that I'll be so happy there, uh, I'll forget about Bulgaria and never return, but that was not true. I met the most horrible people I had ever imagined. I started missing home. As I realized Bath is not my place, I cried every day. I literally wanted to pack my stuff and go back. Don't get me wrong, Bath is a beautiful city honestly and a great tourist destination. But I love crowded places and Bath is the opposite of that, which is not a bad thing, it's just not for me. Of course, as time passed by, I found new friends and I felt better. After everything I've been through, I said to myself that nothing worth having comes easy. Maybe in order to succeed, I need to make sacrifices. So I started studying very hard. I focused entirely on that. I graduated with a very high grade and I'm so proud. And I learned a lot in the field of media communications. And I think that's the most important because that's why I went to Bath. Life literally gave me lemons and I decided to make a lemonade and now I'm proud of myself. I can't say that I experienced only bad things because that isn't true, but I learned a lot throughout this year. I share this with you guys not to scare you from moving abroad, but to motivate you to be brave. Going through a difficult period will only teach you lessons that will help you in the future. I promise. After all, I don't regret anything. I'm keeping my head up and I'm ready to face all the challenges that Bath in the UK will bring me. And you should do too. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you like it. Please subscribe and follow me on Instagram. Hey, Cookie. Say bye.